So Megan, give us a sense. There's an overwhelming sort of preponderance of the polls going one direction, but is it possible they're wrong? It's always possible they're wrong. I think it's really clear, though, that this is a directional poll shift that is different than some of the most recent sort of polling uh, snafus we've seen when people talk about Brexit or they talk about the Scottish referendum or they talk about other polls that were out. This would be an almost historic gap and a historic polling mistake. And also in, this, in the U.S., in terms of how we're polling this race, it's not just a national poll. It's not just one state poll. It's a large number of polls that have come out showing very similar gaps and also showing her quite sizably ahead in several of these key battleground states that are really going to make the difference in the election. For example, in Florida in particular, Donald Trump really has no pathway outside of Florida, and polls have shifted in her favor, although we do see him still trending slightly ahead in Ohio, another key battleground state. So, Megan, we keep hearing from Mr. Trump and his campaign that there are polls that show him ahead. For example, there's this IDB poll that people say has been the most accurate over the last few elections. Should we be paying closer attention to that? I think the issue is is that when you look at Donald Trump and you look at his polling, it's the raw numbers, but it's also the coalition that's behind him that he would need to put together to get himself into the White House. And that's also where we've seen a huge shift. We've seen a huge shift among women's support. We've seen a huge shift actually among male voters as well. And less educated voters sort of had been the bulwarks of his campaign. And we've seen such a, such a move away from him. And those trends are likely to only be exacerbated in the absence of another game-changing type of event. He tried to reset the tone this weekend, I'm not sure he's going to be able to do that with those groups with the kind of speech we saw.